So did you receive any gift cards this holiday that you really don't want? Or maybe you have a handful of gift cards with just small balances remaining and you don't know what to do with them? Well, three on your side consumer reporter Jim Donovan has you covered with ways you can actually make money or snag a deal. Busy mom Laura Hebner is always looking for a deal, so when she found a way to unload some gift cards, she jumped at the chance. I probably had six or seven uh, gift cards for our baby store, and my kids are now getting older, so I swapped them for something I could use for older children. Laura traded her gift cards on a website called cardcash.com. We buy all the gift cards that nobody really wants and has, have no use for, and then we turn around to tell them to people who want them. You have 45 days to go and use the card to make sure that the balance is correct and that it's, it works and everything, so there is a money back guarantee. When you do a trade, a 3 to 20 percent transaction fee is deducted, depending on the popularity of the cards involved. For example, trading a $100 gift card could leave you with anywhere from $80 to a $97 credit. You can also get money back. Any range. You can you can send in a card for five cents or you can send in a card for two thousand dollars three thousand dollars it doesn't make a difference we take anything unlike other websites we take every single card that you would send us we don't have a minimum we don't have a maximum in this case too the amount of money you get back varies on the popularity of the cards you sell for example if you're trying to unload a ten dollar starbucks gift card right now the site will give you eight dollars twenty cents while selling a more popular ten dollar target gift card will get you back nine dollars twenty cents Sense. Target definitely is one of our hottest sellers. Kohl's is another one. Uh, there's always a lot of orders from Macy's, JCPenney, a lot of the department stores, Nordstrom. After you mail in those gift cards, the money is sent to you via check, electronic transfer, or put into your PayPal account. And if you're just in the market to buy a gift card, you can save anywhere from 5 to 28 percent off the face value. For Laura, the site has been more than just a one-shot deal. It worked out great and I've been back a few times since. Cardcash.com accepts gift cards for most major national and regional retailers and restaurants. If you are looking to unload a card and aren't sure if they'll accept them, you can always reach out to them to inquire. I posted a link for you on cbsphilly.com. Click on News Then Consumer or follow me on Facebook. I'll post the information there as well. Reporting for three on your side, I'm Jim Donovan.